All right, Coach Rundles, uh, season gets started on Tuesday. Uh, what are your expectations for the upcoming season? Well, uh, I try not to have too many expectations as far as wins and losses go, but I do expect this team to come out and play hard, uh, give it their best effort every day. Um, I think they got a lot of talent, and if that talent shows up, then we've got a good chance to win. Yes, sir. And you got uh, Jake Nemeth and Braden Lyman. They're all GSC players returning. Mm -hmm. uh, what are your thoughts about them coming up to the season? Well, we got to have them to, you know, they got to have a good year, you know, for us to, to be successful. They're offensively, they're, they're the two that uh, we count on. But we think we have others in the lineup that are going to be just as good. Um, you know, comparing this year to last year, um, we had some guys that, that, that we really think are, are going to be uh, potential GSC players that, you know, had off years last year. And if they play up to their potential, then uh, we'll have a lot more than just Braden and Jake. Outside of Braden and Jake, who are some other players to look out for? Well, I think, uh, you know, Gavin Rogers, uh, he, his sophomore year, he had, a, he had a tremendous year and then he uh, fell off just a little bit last year and we're expecting him to, to step back up. Uh, uh, Jonathan Thibodeau, our catcher, uh, he, he's got to have a good year for us because he, he's the guy behind the plate that uh, he manages the game and we got to count on him. Um, Colden Peoples, we moved to short and play in a position that uh, probably is his second best. He's probably uh, one of our best outfielders, but uh, we need him, the team needs him at short, so uh, we're going to be playing him there most of the time. Uh, you know, our pitching staff, uh, we got a we got a lot of returning guys that that uh, need to have good years for for this team to be successful. But uh, you know I, I think uh, Peyton Warren coming off an arm injury from what he had last year, I think he's going to be uh, feeling better and will be th throwing better than than uh, what he did. Maybe he can match two years ago because uh, he was really good two years ago before the injury. Uh, you know Thomas Booth, another. A uh, solid arm for us that, that's got to be able to throw strikes and do the things that we need him to do. And Mason Hollander, uh, he just needs to be consistent like he has been ever since he's been here. Yes, sir. And what does it mean to have uh, Jacoby back with you on the coaching staff this year? Oh, it's great to have him. He, uh, I was lucky to get him. I, you know, when you, you lose somebody in December and find somebody with his quality and his experience in January, you're very lucky. So, uh, you know, but it's always good to have guys that played here come home and and coach and they got a lot of pride in the program and and that's something that we need here yes sir thank you coach all right